I had fished Biscayne Bay a lot, a, a lot by myself. So, and the fishing was really good. Um, so finding the fish wasn't as big a problem back then as it is now. In fact, I got a hand, my hats off to the the new guides coming up now. Back when I started, there were fish. You just had to go if you had you a pair of them. eyes, and you weren't just completely, uh, you know, crazy about, you know, in the wrong spot because they weren't everywhere. But right. you know, you had spots. Now, the guys that are good now are really good. Where you know, I. You know, are they people teaching thought you? I was good. Are they teaching you these new guys? <laughs> no. Are you kidding me? <laughs> they throw rocks at me when I go down there. But I'm saying, what are you learning from the new guys, if anything? Um, really, I, we don't have any new guys per se in, in Biscayne Bay like right. that. I'm talking about the, the guys in, in Isla Mirada. It, okay. And I don't go down there like I used to. But, you know, people like Jared and, and Richard Black and, and, and those guys, are they're really, really good. Right. What makes them that much better? Uh, Just that fishy instinct. You know, there are always good guides and and okay guides and bad guides. Right. Uh, it, I mean, that's that's always going to be. It's the like same. life, you yeah. know. So those guys just they have they're fishy. You know, like you say, they're they're fishy. You know, I really find.